joining me on my quick blow dry top tips. So today I just thought I'd make a quick video on how to achieve a quick blow dry. So not like a big round fancy blow dry, just a kind of everyday blow dry that I think most of us do. But I'm just sharing with you like my top tips. I am, you know, when I'm at the gym or if I'm getting ready with my girlfriends, you know, I'm watching what people are doing and I just think, golly, you know, not everyone has been told actually how to do a blow dry. So it's just a really quick video for me just to sort of share with you what I know, a bit of my knowledge, <laughs> um, so that you can incorporate it into your sort of quick morning blow dry. Um, today, all you need is a sort of vent brush um, or the brush that you would normally use, your hair dryer and any sort of products that you'd normally use as well. Anyway, I hope you enjoy the video. Okay, so first things first, let's not just start drying our hair when our hair's fresh out the shower. Give it time to sort of air dry first or towel dry it first. This is gonna cut out so much time. Um, you know, put the towel on, do your makeup first, you know, have your breakfast, have a cup of tea. Uh, because if you just start when your hair's absolutely dripping wet, you're gonna be there for hours. Um, also, another top tip, which I see people do all the time, <laughs> is they're, so they're fresh out, they've just towel dried their hair and their hair's like a massive knot like this, okay? And then they're going, yeah, okay, I'm just gonna dry that, shh. No, all that's happening is that your hair's gonna get tangled, it's gonna become dry and matted, and when your hair's wet, it's at its most elastic, so it's just gonna snap and break, so no, 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 okay? Get yourself a comb and just comb that all nice and smooth before you start. So you've towel dried slash air dried your hair, you've combed all nice and smooth. Let's talk about products. So obviously I'm gonna be recommending that, you know, top tip, use a heat protector spray or a heat protector serum um, before you start using any form of heat. But what I do see people do a lot is they've got their product and they put it in their hands and they go, ready. <laughs> You're not ready. Your top layer's ready. What you're best doing is get the product and run it all the way through your hands. Um, today I'm going to be using my heat styling primer. So I just put a little drop into my hands. I rub it all the way through. Not one little blob. All the way through. And just really get it everywhere. You want it to be in all your layers, every strand. You might be using a little bit more product, but just make that product work for you. You know, there's no point just having your top layer done. <laughs> the same with the spray. If you're using like a root volumizing spray, you know, really section each part and spray right into the roots. You know, don't be shy. Make that product really go through your whole hair and you'll get full benefit from it. Next thing um, I see people do all the time, um, and to be honest, I have been guilty of this too, is putting their hair dryer at full heat. The, the logic's there. You're like, okay, full heat, it'll dry quicker. I'm in a rush. I am the honest, 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 like you're doing that at the detriment to your own hair. I am, put it on a medium heat setting. Trust me. It might take just a few more minutes longer, but you know, put it on full blast and the hair is just gonna feel so much better for it. So little bit more time but if you've already towel dried slash air dried your hair you know it shouldn't take too much longer so what we're gonna do I mean like I said before this is a really quick video and um, I'm just gonna kind of power blast my hair a kind of top tip for this is just keeping the airflow direction sort of from root to tip so if you're looking for more volume and your head's tipped upside down that's fine but don't basically what I'm saying is just don't do this <laughs> that is the worst thing you can do. It's just gonna make your hair so rough and dry. You know, keep your hair drier in this direction. You can see already, it's, that's just the way to do it. So even if your hair's upside down, just make sure the airflow is root to tip. Um, so I'm gonna give my hair a massive big blast um, until it's about sort of 70%, 80% dry. Um, I'm gonna skip the video, of course. <laughs> okay, so my hair is 
<clears throat> sort of 7 to 80 percent dry now is the time to get a brush out you know keep your hair nice and smooth it will mean that if you're sort of straightening or curling afterwards you know you've literally cut the work in half um again for a quick blow dry you know yeah you can have your big round brush if you like um but i'm going to be using my vent brush main reason it's got all the air holes through it so i'm maximizing my hair dryer um and again just keeping in mind airflow root to tip so as i'm sort of combing my hair out i'm just making sure the hair dryer is just following the airflow down okay so off camera i've smoothed over my blow dry with my straighteners um, but as you can see, just using all these little techniques, um, I've kind of managed to achieve this sort of silky blow dry that took me minutes, you know, first thing in the morning when you're just trying to get up and go. Um, just to say, to finish off, I'm just going to apply my Oleoplex number six. Um, again, using our new technique that we have learned. We are rubbing all the way through the hands and all the way through the hair. <laughs> I'm going to be checking up on you now. I'm like, um, how do you apply your product? <laughs> and all over the top as well. So thank you very much for watching my kind of quick tips on how to do a quick blow dry. Um, really sort of just to take away from this would just be, you know, let your hair air dry before you start drying. Give it a good blast, keeping the direction of the hair, you know, following down. Um, and if you're using any products just thoroughly thoroughly through the hair let it work for you and um, honestly thank you so much for watching please subscribe to get the latest updates on my next videos and all products that have been used today will be in the description box below thank you so much bye